Bigfoot castle. I don't care how much research you do, you're not going to convince me that there's a Bigfoot. I just follow the evidence and the insanely large footprints. Is there anything that you don't believe in? Sure there is. There's, um... Okay, well, what about you? If not Bigfoot or zombies or ghosts, what do you believe in? I, just, I believe in the everyday magic of life. I mean, things that I can see and touch, like um, the green shoots that pop through the snow in February or the Flatiron Building or the way that I feel when I hear Coltrane. It's... Now, I can appreciate the everyday, but why not live in the possible? The world just doesn't have as many mysteries anymore. There's no new continents to explore. There's no more deepest, darkest Africa. Everything's all mapped out by satellites and sonar, yet still people reach for the unknown. That's what makes us grow. Coltrane wouldn't have had that saxophone if Antoine Sax hadn't imagined it. Isn't that what separates us from, uh, say, moonshine? Well, you know, there is one inexplicable. Mysterious phenomenon that I do believe in still. Us. What was that? Something set off my trap. You said a trap? I got you now, you super rat. What? No one steals from me. Ah! Alexis. <laughs> what are you doing here? She's still not taking my calls. Well, can you blame her, Castle? You practically turned her into a smurf. Navi would be a more contemporary reference. But no, the point is, she lied to me. She looked me right in the eye, and she blamed the borrowers. I'm sure she had a good reason. For what? Not having food? I mean, I give her a sizable allowance. And if that's not enough, she can always ask for more. Like I said, Castle, there are plenty of mysteries in the everyday. Hey, Ryan, 